Hey guys, AJ here and welcome to another video. It's that time of month again. What am I saying? Well, I got some special news for you. This time of month, we've always had this like, you know, well, randomizing of the month, but besides the point. We have applications open for the Reforgers community! That's right, if you must know, the Reforgers community is a community we have built up for, you know, years now. It's been like, you know, believe me or not, it's actually been two years since it's been up. And, you know, we always uh, make new applications for new people to come and join us to create amazing stories with us with Minecraft. Now, I'm just gonna say this now, there has been a few changes since the last application. And also, I am on the DSR server with just me surrounded by all these uh, props. I know this is kind of a weird way out for me to start off uh, a promotion for our application. But yeah, anyways, applications are now opened up. So if you want to join the Reforgers uh, community and join the work server and to create uh, awesome Minecraft roleplay stories with us, the link is in the description to apply. But there's going to be a few changes on how we're going to operate it, so you got to listen closely to how I'm going to show you how to apply, okay? Let's go. Okay, first things first, always be the rules, okay? We want to make sure that every day, every day, everybody's respected, and we are always civil when we work together. Spamming? <laughs> you can tell just how many times we have to make sure that, you know, we don't hear the same thing or deal with the same thing over and over again. Always spamming, it's a common thing, you know, common sense there. Yeah, never, just never in a million years. Especially when we're working with people who do not like this kind of stuff, so don't do this, okay? Always stick to uh, rule 3, just don't do all this stuff. Yeah, um, we are working together, which, you know, we're in this together, but like, don't come in if you're gonna plan on just only promoting yourself and your own thing. Trust me, it doesn't work that way. We're in this together and, you know, we just didn't fight you just so you'd be able to, you know, promote your own stuff, okay? But, unless otherwise, we do have uh, something like this around. If you wanna promote yourself, you do it right here, but, you know, that's only when you wanna promote yourself. Just don't come in the server if you're just only gonna promote yourself. We're here to work and get to know each other and to create amazing stories. You can only promote yourself in a certain uh, chat, and we'll explain that in a bit. Uh, yeah, you really think by now that like when we're in a group, we always got to make sure we're comfortable working together. So never do this stuff at all. And never try to anger anybody else's, otherwise, you know, we might have a problem. We want to work together and get to know you guys and, you know, to create awesome stories, there's no reason for us to fend or deal with any other issue. If you guys bring that up to the server, we can't really accept it and, you know, you lose your chance. Now, this we do not tolerate at all. And, you know, for those who have Discord, you know, you know the Discord TLS. Yeah, um, why is for you not to do this either? Because there's reasons we have a lot of designers, skinners, yeah, we just, you know, don't want things to get mixed up and, you know, we don't want more confusion or have this kind of rule abuse, so please make sure you read Rule 8. Yeah, we want to make sure we are 100% committed. If there's a reason why you're not active, tell us now and don't uh, tell us later, okay? And, well, we gotta make sure that we keep tabs with you guys so that way, you know, we help you if you need anything, and if you're stuck with anything, just let us know, but you, we can't always say quiet, we always, always, always need to speak up, no matter what. And this one, yes, we are working together, so therefore we gotta get to know each other and, you know, be comfortable with who we're working at. And if you're making another person uncomfortable, we're gonna tell you're doing it. So. Please, if you are making someone uncomfortable when they know, then you gotta stop that, okay? You know, rules of ten. Terms and conditions. Now this one, well, as you may know, we have all these certain requirements that are really important to us. So you gotta make sure you have all the certain stuff so, you know, it'd be easier for us to work together. This is where we get to know each other. 
how we get to know you as a person and get to know you what you've done in the past as well. So always you want to have a name that we want you want to be preferred as. You put it right here, your preferred name, your Discord tag ID because that's we need to know that as well. It's required. Your age baggage because we're inviting people in certain age. But, you know, you always gotta make sure you put it through this, okay? I'm not quite sure whether we will have certain people through 25 to 26 or 30 or older, but there is a chance, so always be honest with your age. If you try to lie about your age, that's gonna be a huge setback and we will not tolerate that. Your pronouns, we respect any pronouns, so he, him, she, her, they, them, and it's any, none, other. You could check mark these, you really can. And whatever you know your pronoun is, you just put it right here. Your time zone, if it is in A plus or minus region, please specify. Because all of us are in different time zones, so we wanna know what your time zone is so it'd be easier for us to work because you know we don't have the same time zones and it gets slightly tricky for us. And then your socials. Um you could put the one either as many as you could or just the one that you use the most and that you're most familiar with be YouTube, Twitch, uh, Twitter, you know, all that stuff. Okay, next page. This is the tricky part of the application. So we have certain rules here and we have them separately so it'll be easier for you guys to understand. So here's the first question. Do you want to be a POV creator? We have yes, no, or maybe. We have the maybe option just in case you aren't sure yet and once, you know, I guess you are sure, you let us know. Having a POV means you can record episodes and post them in your YouTube channel, your perspective of a certain roleplay series we're doing. Such examples like we did in FTR and DSR. I have a POV, my friends have a POV, some of us have a POV if you're familiar with it. Or you could just be a side character who could still have an impact of a storyline of any of the Minecraft roleplay series we've done. And you know, you don't have to record or anything. Again, uh, that's if you're sure. If you're not sure, you just put maybe. But you're, you're, regardless if you're recording this, yeah, if you're not recording this, that's fine. Your story could still make an impact to the series and our community. It would mean a lot if we have side characters. Now... Besides all those two options, we also have these options. What do you want to apply as? So, you know, whatever your forte is, you have more than one, you could check more. You could be a builder, body actor, thumbnail artist, voice actor, you could be all if you're able to do all that stuff. Builders, you gotta help us build stuff, like build as much as you can, you know, build us a setup that we'll be recording in, in whatever series we're doing. Body acting, help body act for certain cinematics or for certain people if they need body actors. Thumbnail artists, so that way you can uh, help us with thumbnails because if you must know, we love seeing you guys' art and we would like that to be represented to our channel and you know, it represents you and it will tell us like what the episode's about just by the showing. And then voice acting, you know, you guys might be good at voice acting, so if you want to voice act for certain characters, you're welcome to do so. Now, have you done any previous work we can show us? Do not attempt to link us to your PC. We cannot access your file explorer. If you do not have previous work, just type in NA. Any work you've done in the past that's Minecraft roleplay related, uh, you put here so that way we can see your work and then it'll, it'll be a higher chance for us to prove you joining us in this community. Now, why do you want to join us? You gotta be honest with this one. Tell us the reason why you want to join and then we'll look into it and see what we could do for you. And you know, there's, it could be a long sentence or short, that's up to you. Now, can you install and run Minecraft mod packs? If so, any issues? Yes, no, I never tried. A few hiccups, but nothing catastrophic. You know how mod packs work, you know. Having too many mods could, you know, make a, a person's PC crash, computer crash, or make things laggy. So, any of these uh, issues you have, or if no issue, just like press no. But any particulars, just give us a heads up so we could just slightly help you with that. Uh, these three options right here. Do you have headphones and microphones? Now, for this particular, you got if you're gonna voice act and you know have a POV or side character, you gotta have a headphone or a microphone. 
but if you only have one, that's fine too, we can work something out with it. The next thing we have is, how much can you give to the team? We want to see as much commitment as we can from you guys, how much you really want to join this community, how much you want to express yourself of how much you love Minecraft roleplays and storytelling in particular. So whatever it is you're going to give us the team, we will really appreciate it. It just has to be that high level of commitment, 110% commitment. And you gotta be honest with this answer as well. Okay, next page. Okay, so we do have to take a lot of liberty to list some reasons you could not be accepted. And here's the reason why. If you do not have a microphone, Discord account, or Minecraft account, there's no way you'd be able to join us. It's kind of impossible to join something if you don't have these certain requirements. If there's a lack of answers, such as if we don't hear from you for a long time, or, you know, if anything if there's a lack of answers in this application it kind of decreases your chances of joining us if these questions are answered incorrectly it'll be hard for us to act to process uh, what you're really wanting to do for us so we, we won't be able to accept that uh, we gotta really be suspicious on certain pe individuals who join us you know anything off or sketchy we will take note and you know that might decrease your chances so Try to be fully honest with yourself and try not to skate through anything, okay? If you do not pass our background check, then you can't join. And if you're known to have history with certain drama or things that no one doesn't want to be associated with, I'm sorry, that you cannot join something if you have past stuff such as that. Even when you're trying to move on from it, we're just not sure. Read this carefully before submitting. Do you recognize that you cannot, under any circumstances, give away spoilers? If we find out you are, you have we have no choice but to terminate you from the team because we keep this up to ourselves and when we work on ourselves, we gotta keep it secret to our viewers because if you guys try to show up stuff that we do in the work server, it's automatically terminated from the team. We just cannot have that. Now, if you recognize any of the circumstances, well, you gotta answer honestly with this too, most importantly. And that's the application for the Reforgers community. Hopefully I explained that better, if I didn't I do apologize, but I am excited to welcome you guys to the community. And just remember the rules and what's required and how much commitment you guys need to give for this because I know most of you guys are talented out there, so that's why I want to make sure that if you really want to do this, you gotta say it now and speak up. And trust me, it'll be worth a while because if you enjoy doing Minecraft roleplays and storytelling and if you enjoy working with people, this is the place to be. We welcome as much people as we can if you give us a lot of effort. This team needs help and you guys could be a part of that and you guys can make a big difference to the community if you can. And if you try, that works too. Anyways, I think that's all for this application. I tried to make this sound exciting as I could, but, you know, <laughs> for me, <laughs> I just feel like I talk too much. Remember the rules? Uh, the um, application is in the link in the description for this video. It might be in other socials if you could find it. Always answer the application as honestly as you can, okay? And, you know. Wait till what happens, for more uh, information will be explained after you apply, when you are accepted that is, or when you're pending, okay? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in for this uh, application uh, video. This is like our, I don't know how many, this might be our third time uh, promoting the Reforgers application, which would be a daily month uh, thing, but it's not going to be an every month thing, so... And this is an update one too, so we're raising the bar for the Reforgers community. I'm hoping you guys could join us in this journey. Anyways, I love you guys. Stay tuned for more. And check out my friend's perspective of any Reforgers episodes that they've done in the past. Like FTR or DSR. Trust me, it'll be worth a watch. Anyways, see you guys in the next video. Peace out!